Hey everybody, Bulbazak here, and we are back on the regular path, and I can record a little bit more freely right now, so we're going to be tackling, hopefully, uh, a big portion of the rest of this regular path, and we're going to start with the secret exit to Into the Water. Oh, I remember this path. Anyway, watch out for the wild water, it will suck you down. Yes, that water down below us that looks has a weird graphics, watch what happens when we go down. Um, yay! Now it's just all a matter of me doing this exactly right. So, I'm going to move as far as I can to get down here. Okay. So yes, yeah, that's, that's kind of the whole thing right here, is to kind of move and watch out for the wild water here. So, you know, just keep that in mind here. And here we go! So, I'm going to save state and move up here. There's something interesting up here. Uh, overall, this is kind of like a quick level. Yep. Fire flower. Fire flower is good. I'm just going to go back around, on the, back around the long way because... You know what? I don't really want to mess with the wild water. But, yeah. Um, this is an interesting mechanic. I... I you would think it would be an annoying mechanic, but not so much, actually. As long as you know what you're doing. So... I'm going to be going through this as best as I can. Trying to get through these sections without damage. We'll see how well I do. Because I have a whole lot on my agenda this time. Okay, I, I got a little cocky there. So, move here, and, uh... Okay, move over. Move over some more. Move... Oh, crap. Come on. Move over more here, and more here, and... You think I'd be learning the pattern by now. So, I move over here for a little bit. Move over here. And straight down the middle. Now, all we have to do is come on down to the end. And the secret should be in here somewhere. So, oh, I remember this secret. This is an interesting secret. Um, you have patches of water and not water. As you can see, the key is right there. So we have to be a little bit more cautious. So, come on. Not a really hard jump. Okay. This is really helps if you have a fire flower, so. Kinda move with the groove here. Oh, come on. Not that hard. Let's go. Maybe I should safe state right here, so I'm not dealing with this jump again. Okay. Come on. Okay. Now the key should be coming up soon. Actually, it's down here. So, now... Now it's time to move with the key, which will just make our life easier, uh, life more difficult. Okay, I probably should have done it to begin with. wonky water mechanics. You pretty much find out how water mechanics are if you're doing some really crazy stuff with this. So, straight on down here, and really, oh, I remember this jump. Okay, 
I got it right the first time. Okay, let's try it this way. Yeah, this is gonna be a little bit annoying. Hey, I got that that way. Okay, and we just merely just go to the keyhole here. Okay, that's not too bad, and that's going to take us all the way. Well, to Glacial Grave. So let's tackle this level, shall we? I'm just going to make my way through this level as best I can. Let's get another nice little mushroom here. Whoa. Okay. Okay, that was not the button I wanted. Good thing we got, we got some switches in the game. But right now, this is causing me more havoc than it should. This actually is not a hard level. It's pretty easy. Especially if you see you got the green switch. I've seen videos of people who did this without the green switch, and why? Just do it afterwards. It's a lot easier. Okay, moving up. Let's just do it this way. Okay, and we are halfway through this nice little level here. So what's left is scrolling. So, you know, not bad. Just keep your wits about you. It's just... Speaking of keep your wits about you, nice little scrolling. Okay, quit being impatient here, Baba. Come on, Baba. Not that hard. Want to do some other stuff this episode? Okay. Come on. Slippery. It's so slippery. Come on. There we go. Feather. I got a feather. I got a feather. I got a feather. I lost a feather. Okay, that's good. Okay. We are actually... Think... Yes, the exit's right there. Okay. Don't know why that was causing so much havoc with me there at the end, but yeah, there we go. We're doing pretty good. And if you beat that level, it's a dead end. It doesn't go anywhere. But, you know, it's nice to beat it and show, show it off. So we're going to go back to, uh, into the water and get the regular exit. Which, I, I don't think there's really that much more to the level. But we're going to go through anyway. And why didn't I save state earlier? So move over here and then move all the way over here. What the crap? I will take that, because that was so... I won't take that. What was that? I've never had that happen to me before. That was really weird. So, let's go through this. Ay, 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 ay. I don't know, that... That just weirds me out right there. Okay, I went for, for that last time. I'm not going for the fire flower last time. Show that off. I'm not going to go for it this time. So let's move over this way. I 
think what they want you to do is kind of weave in and out for, with these fishes. But you know what? We don't have to do that, so we won't. And that will always, by the way, push you down. So... So... We are back here again, but this time we do not... We're not going for the key, so... That should make our lives a little bit easier. That and we don't have a fire flower. Okie dokie, then. Okay. Way through this. I'm still not getting through that way, so I'll just go through the hard and bothersome way. And you know what? I'll just get the mushroom this way. It's a little bit easier. Okay. And we go through this door. And we have a scrolling underwater level. Oh, I remember this. This is a pain. This is painful. How am I going to... I remember I had a hard time with this last time. I have to go extra careful. I have to be extra careful now. How am I going to do this? Well, I guess I'm going about to find out, huh? Okay. Well, okay. That wasn't that wasn't as bad as it was in my practice run. So, this is interesting, though. So, ooh, nice. I didn't do that. I have never done that one before. Just, you have to be careful because you fall in the water, it's instant death. So, we're just going to be careful. And fall in the water only when we have to. But other than that, really not that hard. Just a little bit of memorization. To watch out because it pushes you down. But other than that, we're good. Ooh, feather, feather, feather. I has a feather, I has a feather, I has a feather, yay, 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 yay. Come on. Okay, I have to do some really pinpoint precise jumps here to avoid that ledge. Come on. Okay. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, feathers are definitely making this part easier. Okay. I'm just gonna wait for this for this guy to pass. Come on, Spike Top. Move it, move, 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 move it. I'm through. Nice. I'm doing good. And we are done with the secret exit. So, that should leave only one level left. Can you guys guess what it is? Come on, come on, come on. If you're looking at the if you're looking at the title, I guess you know what it is. We are finally gonna be tackling Lulu Boo's mansion. It's been a while. We've been hitting at this for about two videos now. And if you couldn't guess, it was a ghost house. So, so we have a little bit of some puzzly stuff here to do. 
Um. Oh boy. One of these ghosts. Go through. This is actually a little bit of a puzzle, this entire level. So, we're gonna move through. Wait, what's this? Don't have boo boss. Don't hurt me! I'm just here for the debu debutante ball. Tick tock, watch the clock. Lulu will blue Lulu Boo won't be happy you're here. Yeah. Ghost Boo, uh, Boo Boss won't really hurt you that much. Unfortunately here. Oh boy. Robotic fish of death. Yeah, that's right. Instant death fish. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I'm going to be kind of trying to rush through this. Because I hate this fish. I really, really hate this fish. Robotic fish of death. Robotic fish of death. And why is that eerie bath giving me so, so much trouble now? Come on. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm just gonna wait here. Please. Going down. Okay. I survived the ro robotic fish of death. But now. I have, a, have some underwater... Whoa! What was that? I kind of went schizo on me there. Okay. Doing good. Doing good. Move. Come on. Okay. Come on. This is too slow, guys. Oh, look, there's a key. Hmm, what's down here? Come on. Okay, we're good. And I'm going to go this way this time. Come on. Let's go, Mario. Let's take this key where it needs to be. It should be this door with a suspicious keyhole. Yeah, I've done this puzzle before. It's a little lengthy. Okay. So. Now those blocks have kind of turned a little bit. So every time, everywhere there were... Um, Outlines before, there are now these solid boo blocks, and every time where there are solid boo blocks before, there are now those nice little outlines. So, ooh, smiley face. So we we're going all the way back here, and I'm not going to get that. And now we will taunt the fish because we don't need to get all that. We can just go straight this way. Oh. Only the boo bloody rings are giving us a little bit of problems. So that's a straight shot through this door. Lulaboo, holy sugars. Y'all are wrecking my party in my ho house. Y'all think you can clean my clock? Y'all best think twice now. That's right. Lulaboo is a fishing boo. I hate fishing boos. I really do. They're my least favorite enemy in any Mario game. Especially Super Mario World. So, I'm going to be taking it a little easy. At least as easy as I can. And see if I can at least keep this cape for the duration of this. Ooh. 
the duration of this level. Yeah, that's just my uh, timer. Come on. Come on. I'm going to take this down here. Hmm. I wonder why I could use this P-switch. I don't know, you guys are probably going, you don't sound too convincing at, at all. Well, I don't want to get too excited. Hey, look, there's a clock. They've been saying a lot of stuff about clocks. So let's enter in. Welcome, guys, to the boss fight. This is the boss fight of the world. This is just a boss fight for this level. And we are facing Lulubu. That's right, we have a fishing boo for a we have a fishing boo for a boss fight. Okay, I'll take that. How many times have I hit her? How many times are you supposed to hit her? Five times, I'm guessing. So with that, Lulu Boo is down. We've finally taken down this annoying boss that has been kind of taunting us for three videos now. So next time, now that we've finished, we beat Lulu Boo. We are going to actually go to the actual castle and beat the actual boss for World Seven. And believe me, this is going to be annoying. It's not going to be a cakewalk. But we're we're going to leave that for the next video. That and the last level of World 7. So until then, guys, I am Bulbazak, signing out.